So guys, hi there, it's Mangamix, it's 10.15 in the morning on whatever day this is, Saturday, and we're playing a cat lady and we're going to play it until we're done. Even if this video is an hour long, we're going to play it until we're done, so let's do this. Come on Susan, we've got a, a rendezvous to organise. Just look at this door, crazy son of a bitch, that's not going to stop us. I think there's someone in the kitchen. It's probably him, seeing as he invited us here. Fucking hell. You right, I am Adam, how you doing? Are you... Are you Adam? Me? No, of course not. I don't have anything to do with all this foolishness. Never have. Oh, someone else lives there. Ah! That's my son. I've told him time and time again, but he never listens. Oh well, I mind. I've done my best to protect that boy, you know. I'm all he's got left in the world since his mama died. But Aww. it just wasn't enough. Poor mama. Where is he then? Where's Eye of Adam? He's in his room. Where else would he be? Encouraging people to kill themselves. He's always in his room. Staring at that screen for as long as he can. Look. I've made up my mind about this. I want to help you. Or help, help us kill him? This mess he's in. It's gone too far. I don't... I, I can't be part of this. What are you talking about? Oh, you don't understand. He's watching us. Right now, he can see us on his camera. Fucking hell. He's very clever with this stuff. I never got my head around it. Just as much as I needed to, I guess. But not a lot. Give us the key to his room. I want to talk to him. Look, it's a trap. It's a trap! He knows why you're here, and he will kill you. Wonderful. Let's go. Both Where's of that? you. But he will not kill me. He won't dare. I reckon he'll kill you, dude. these years, I've looked after him well. He owes me everything. It breaks my heart to do this now. What choice do I have? He left me this. I was supposed to keep it for myself. Suicide pill or something? I want you to take it. He won't dare to kill his own father. And I won't let two innocent lives be lost because of him. Interesting. What is it? Just take the damn thing. There's not much time. I wish I knew Don't what the fuck is going on. He's watching. Is he too scared to come out of his room or what? Adam's father, take box. Is what is it, Mrs. A? It's a shoebox. Take it away! Get rid of it! He must see that I don't have it anymore! Shall we open it? Okay, we're gonna open the box. It's a gas oh, mask. Mitzi, we have to get out of here. Quickly. Is it a gas mask? Yeah, it is. It's a gas mask. He's going to poison us. Oh, shit. Oh, great. Well, we're fucked, aren't we? Mind you, at least we can die. Fuck shit, fuck shit, fuck. Oh, God, this is not good. It's too late! Shit. Oh, shit. What? Mitzi, get, shit. give Mitzi the mask. Shit. No! Mitzi, get Stop the fucking mask. That, Adam. You're going to kill your father. We'll never make it to the door. That room is filling up with gas too quickly. Put the mask on, Mrs. A. No, because... What about you? No. You can no, die, Susan. I can't. Give it to Mitzi. You've got to. This is your only chance. I... No. I can't let you die. Not like this. It's my fault that you're here. I'm dying anyway. And you... You've got to live, Mrs. A. You'll live and you'll be happy again. You are... You've been a great friend, Mrs. A. Oh, fuck. Uh, give Master Mitzi. No. You've got a date. And I'll make sure you turn up for it. I can't. Take the there fucking mask. There is no mask. time to argue. I'll be fine. Now. Do it! Okay, so Mitz is going to survive. We're going to die, but we'll go to Limbo and come back and everything will be fine. 
and me and the old man are gonna die. That is really grim. Mitzi, think of a vegetable while I'm gone. Haha! <laughs> <laughs> I'm laughing my head off when the old guy's dying in the corner there, horribly, but still. Oh well, we'll be back soon. We got a parasite to clean up after all. I don't know whether it's I of Adam or Joe or here, but it doesn't really matter. We'll kill them anyway. And then we'll shit on their grave. Hi Rainbow, how are you doing? How's it been, Mr. Raven? Let's have a chat, shall we? Oh no, we're gonna go and see death, probably, I don't know. Da -ba -da through the corn. So every day you remember we have good times today. Ba 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 da da do oh god doors twitching twitchy door don't like twitchy door Hi Death, how you doing? How's it going? Welcome home, darling. I've been waiting for you. What took you so long? Say what you've gotta say and let's finish this. I'm tired of you. I'm tired of all this madness. Fucking hell, Susan, she's just saved your life again. I just need to get back. Very well. I'm not planning to keep you long. Let's go inside. I have one last job for you. Okay, French death, let's go. Je m'appelle Death. Anything? There are Sorry. still <laughs> two candles left, Susan. You know how this works. A soul for a soul. Oh, we can come back again? Okay. That's and plenty that's of it. time. I blow out the last candle and I'll never have to see you again. Only if you blow out the right one, I'll never bother you again. Isn't that what you want? Oh but shit. If you choose wrong, it will be your life extinguished forever. Oh bum. Just take a deep breath and do it. Well, we're definitely gonna say but prior how should to I this. Know which one's right? That's the thing, Susan. You can't know that. In life, you can't always know the consequences before you make a decision. Haven't you learnt that yet? That's uh, not fair. Nothing is fair. Shut up, French Death. Don't like you. You opened your heart talking to that doctor, and he butchered you like an animal. Then, those disgusting cannibals. They'd chop you up and cook you for dinner if you'd let them. Uh-huh. And what about the man with the flowers? All that he wanted was to hear you play before he split your skull open. Hmm. The way your husband treated you. The way your neighbors laughed at you for years just for being different. You did not deserve all that. And yet, it happened. Ah. Uh, Am I forgetting something? No, you're not. Oh, yeah, Joe and his oh, fat yes. dead wife. Of course. Most of all, was it fair that... Shut up! Oh, the baby shit. <laughs> Just shut up, you ugly bitch! Kick her in the vagina. Now I know who you really are. All those feelings I had in me for years. Oh, she's, she's her depression. That bitter guilt and self-pity. That hatred for myself and everyone else. Hmm. You are that miserable illness that's consumed my heart all these years. You, always there, always. Every day I looked at you in the mirror, like a dark cloud I couldn't see through. This is all very interesting. I let you take control of my life. I believed it was right to feel like this. But not any longer. This ends here. Oh, I'm gonna then fucking blow own you, bitch. Out the candle. It's the. It's the candle. Can I refuse? Uh. Oh well. Game over, guys. Well done, Susan. What? Oh my God, I'm back. Tomato. You were thinking about a tomato, right? <laughs> yes! Oh god, thank god! <laughs> so does Mitzi know that I'm invincible now? Because, um... Tomato is a fruit, silly. Who cares? I like tomatoes. Tomatoes, not tomatoes. So do I. But, I hate to disappoint you, 
but I was really thinking of onions. Also, Why onions? They're the saddest of the vegetables, of course. They make people cry. Sad onions everywhere. I... What happened, Mrs. A? I saw you die. And yet, you are here. Alive, like, if nothing's ever happened. Uh, I'm well, really strong. let's put it this way. Everyone knows cats have nine lives. So do cat ladies, apparently. Awesome. But this time, I feel there won't be second chances. I'm down to one last life now. I can't afford to waste it. Oh god, this is bad. You are such a nutter, Mrs. A. You are absolutely fucking bonkers. I love you, Mitzi. Your dialogue is amazing. But I'm so happy to see you. Never, ever do that to me again, alright? I can happily promise you that, Mitzi. This is it. His room is through that door. It's time to face the eye of Adam. What are we waiting for? Let's do it. Let's do it, guys. Let's save our game first, though. Oh, Mitzi, if you were heterosexual and weren't about to die, and not a fictional video game character, and I was single, and okay, fuck it, it's not gonna work out, Mitzi. Sorry. How you doing, I Adam? How's it going? You're... You're the Eye of Adam? A pathetic, wheelchair-bound invalid? Is this a joke? Do you... Do you know who I am? Do you know what you've done to me? Kick his ass, Mitzi. You fucking murderer! Tonight it's your turn to die. I'm gonna paint this room with your brains and I'm gonna watch and smile. Just shoot him, hurry up, I swear sake. to God I'll do it. Just do it, come on, I've got a day. Well, nothing to say? Nothing at all? Aren't you going to beg for your sad little life? He hasn't got much of one, to be fair. Say something! Anything! Kill him. Just kill him. Mitzi. Where did you get that gun from? It was inside her bum, that's where she kept a gun. Shut it up, doesn't sir. matter. Please, Mrs. A. This is something I have to do. You are free to leave if you want. You don't have to be a part of it. Just try to understand. Just shoot him, Mitzi, come on. Please, just get Beg over with. forgiveness, you scum. He's not gonna say anything. What the fuck is wrong with you? You don't believe I'm gonna shoot you, do you? Oh, I've dreamt of this moment for so long. Oh, Look at this man, away. Mitzi. He hasn't twitched a muscle since we entered the room. I think he's paralyzed. How did he set up the poison? How did That's he possibly impossible. hear that? He's lying to us. He's faking it. Do something. Talk for God's sake. I need you to answer me. I need to know. He won't answer you. He can't talk. Fucking hell. Then how did he post all that stuff online? What the? He's like a serial killer, Stephen Hawking. Hi, my name is I of Adam. Yeah, it's, this is what he does. We meet at last. <laughs> it's like James Bond. How did he do it? <laughs> we meet I at last, Mitzi. See that little device on his left eye? I've heard about these. It's a controller. It seems the only part of his body he can move is his eyeball. Controller connected to the computer tracks its movement, allowing him to... What? That's ridiculous. How do you even know such things? I'm a nurse? I've seen these before. Well... I've seen eye-controlled wheelchairs, but there's no reason why it wouldn't work with a computer. Why can't Susan say seen properly? Jesus. That would explain the whole eye of Adam thing. Ah, he's the eye, yeah. He really is just the eye. Interesting. But no. That doesn't change anything. He must die. 
He deserves nothing more. Fucking shoot him, for fuck's sake, get it over with. Please. He's gonna say something like, haha, pwned. Today is a good day. I'll do it. What? You arrogant shit! Just shoot him! Do it. For fuck's sake, Tell me shoot one him. Thing. One thing. Why did you make Jack kill himself? I guess these are all pictures of his victims on the roof and stuff. How the hell did he hang them up? Like, it's ridiculous. I know this is just plot inconsistencies and it works and stuff in terms of a story and stuff. Come on. Come on. What's he gonna say? I am error. Pull that trigger, you'll find out. Fine. It'll be a pleasure. Ready to die, scumbag? Uh. Look at these oxygen tanks. I don't think it's a good idea. Look at these oxygen tanks. I don't think it's a good idea. What? Why not? I'm the one holding a gun here. And I will blow this bastard's brain out. As soon as he looks at me. They're very flammable. You hear me? Look at me. I want you to see what you've done. The pain you've caused me. He doesn't give a fuck. Nancy, that's not what I meant. Just put the gun down for a second. No! Oh god, no. we're gonna die again because you're gonna block the room. I can't do that, Mrs. A. I'm sorry. This is something I have to do. I have to. Can't you hear that hissing sound? These cylinders are clearly leaking gas. Please stay out of it. Oh god, Mrs. You'll gonna make show herself. a whole room blow up. I don't care. Just leave me alone. Uh, you lied to me. You never said you wanted to kill him. You lied to me. You never said you wanted to kill him. Now, wasn't that quite obvious? What I did you think so. I wanted to do? Have a coffee with him? Chat about the weather or, or politics? Yeah, I suppose so. For God's sake. I'm here because this son of a bitch needs to die. If I don't kill him now, he'll just carry on and more innocent people will lose their lives. She has a point, Susan. Do you really uh, want that? Because I don't. Uh. Think about this for a second. Would Jack really want this? Think about it for a second. Would Jack really want this? Now talk her down. He, this bastard messed with Jack's head. He tricked him! That's what he does! He fucking tricked him! But would Jack really want you to become a murderer? No. He wouldn't. Put the gun down, Mitzi. Think of Jack. He wasn't violent at all. He was the kindest, sweetest guy I ever knew. Exactly! Now, put that gun down already. Calm down, Mitzi. Come on, Mitzi. Come on. Come on, but stay with me. what about me? Come no, on. I'll do it. I know Jack will forgive me. Uh, this isn't the way to do it. Just turn these computers off. This isn't the way to do it. Just turn these computers off instead. No! He doesn't deserve to live after what he's done. Fuck. And who are you to serve justice like this? Do you really want to kill an unarmed, paralyzed man? Why are you doing this, Mrs. A? I thought you were my friend. That's exactly why I'm doing this. Calm down, Even Mitzi. if we survive the explosion, how will you be able to live with yourself? I won't have very long to live with it. I'll manage just fine. Without his father, he's harmless. Without his father, he's harmless. I think she's going to do it. He whatever, was the one who supplied still. him with all this technology. He fulfilled his every single wish. I know this guy's rotten bad. There's no excuse for what he did. But he will be punished for it. Trust me. They'll put him in some stinking nursing home. He'll live his life like a vegetable. Stuck to bed. He'll have time to think about what he's done. Oh, yeah. And he'll That's never cool. see a computer screen again. Isn't that enough? That's good. Yeah, come on. Missy, come on. Stay he with said, me. do it. He wants to die and I want to kill him. He wants us all to die, can't you see that? He wants us all to die, can't you see that? 
Isn't that what he's been preaching? A joint suicide. That's why he wants you to shoot him. So we can all get blown to pieces. Come on, Mitzi, think. Come on. His final act. The work of his life. Fuck me, this is Are tense. you really going to give him that satisfaction? It's really tense, guys. Remember what you said about feeding the troll? Oh, That's yeah. That's exactly what you're going to do if you kill him now. Don't feed the troll, Mitzi. Don't do it. Come on. No. Maybe you're right. Exactly. Come on. I'm right. You should leave, Mrs. A. I'd never want you to get hurt. But I'm not going away without this fucker dead. Even if that means I die too. Oh, Mitzi. 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 Have you lost your mind? Yes, she has. You're going to sacrifice your life for this scum? He's a parasite. A worthless, evil piece of shit. Parat is not like I've got anyone to live for, is it? What? What about your mother? Your family? She's dead. Yeah, I lied. Oh. I always lie. Yeah, that's not good. I grew up in an orphanage. My family never wanted to know me. The only person that cared about me was Jack. And he's dead! Yeah. Fuck. Happy now? Yeah, I'm great, yeah. Brilliant. So We're gonna die. Get out of here and let me do what I got to do. Uh, I care about you. Do it for me. I care about you. Do it for me. Then you two make out. Come on. Damn it! Come on. Ah. Oh. Ah! Oh. <sighs> Come on, mate. It's been a long day. Let's go home. We've won. Have we really? Trust me. I know we have. Oh. I'm the cat lady. From now on, I win every single day. Fuck yeah, Susan. Fuck yeah. I'm so pleased, guys. That was amazing. That was that was an unbelievably tech. That was so well written. Mr. Harvester Games, you fucking rock. Thank you so much for following the LP. It's me, again, talking about my ordinary little life, as usual. I'm still surprised anyone would want to read this at all. The ramblings of a cat lady. Maybe I'm not a cat lady anymore. Things have changed here since Mitzi's death. Oh, she died of cancer. I'll never forget those last few weeks. It's a horrible way to die. Stuck in a hospital bed with no hope and whole life to pass you by. That's really sad. Six months ago, I lost the best friend I'd ever had. But at least we knew it was coming. That's really sad. I'm going to cry. It, <laughs> just like she did. And I can only be glad we spent that time together. Oh, God, guys. <laughs> I still miss her, though. Every day. That's really sad. Did I ever mention I got into all this because of her? Oh god. I opened her laptop the night after the funeral. And there it was. A friend request. Over a year old. A little <laughs> gift from behind the grave. I met some people. We go out sometimes. And I'm not alone anymore. <laughs> This is really sad. It turned out there were others who felt like I did. I talked to them. Tried to help. Oh, God. That's really sad. <laughs> but at the same time, it's uh, it's good. It's bittersweet. Um, I don't really know what to say, guys. Uh, <laughs> I'm in properly in floods of tears. <laughs> Oh god. Uh Oh. This has been one of the best games I have ever played in my entire life. And uh you have to vote for it on Steam Greenlight, guys. If you haven't got Steam, make a and Steam now account and vote for it. I'm writing this blog. I must confess. Yesterday was bad. The fuck is this? It was one of those days when you feel like you're back in the past and all the good stuff that happened was just a dream. Oh, we still got a bit more to do. 
I, th I think, maybe, possibly, I'm not sure. Oh, but I woke God. up today feeling better. <laughs> maybe I can never get rid of it. This invisible illness. I know how you feel, Maybe Susan. it will always be living somewhere deep inside me. Asleep. Waiting. And when it'll hit me, it'll hit me hard. Hmm. That's beautiful. Oh my god. Um... <laughs> I'm speechless. <laughs> but if there's one thing Mitzi taught me, it's that you have to pick yourself up and carry on. Indeed it doesn't do. matter that life isn't fair. It doesn't matter that you make mistakes. You fall and rise again. Mm -hmm. Worlds full of liars, traitors, cowards. But every now and then, you meet someone like Mitzi, who will just smile at it all. <laughs> now, oh my God. I've forgiven the world and myself too. I teach myself to smile again. One day I'll get there. I know I will. Even if it takes me not nine, but nine hundred lives. That was a work of fucking art, guys. Oh my god.
press any key to live. So guys, that was the cat lady. I really hope you enjoyed. For me, I actually liked it more than The Walking Dead in the end. Um, one of the best games I've ever played. Uh, thank you very much Harvester Games for making it. Remember to vote for it on Steam Greenlight if you haven't. It really needs it. So, um, yeah. It's an amazing game. And uh, I hope you guys will join me on another adventure very soon. I'm going to be doing a lot more story-driven horror adventure games on the channel. As for Joe and his wife, I may well do Downfall at some point, although I won't be doing it immediately. That's the other game by uh, by Harvester Games, and um, it focuses on them as well, so we'll see. Um, yeah, there's a lot of stuff I want to do at the moment, so expect a pilot episode of a new Let's Play soon, and see what you can give me your verdict on what you think. Uh, anyway, guys, bye for fucking now. It's uh, been a hell of a ride, and... Um, if you enjoyed the video, like, favourite, comment, subscribe, share the playlist, spread the word about this RP, spread the word about the game, because it deserves it. Bye for fucking now, Mixlings. I'll see you really soon.